Welcome to This Week in Refi, your place to catch up on the progress made in the world of regenerative finance and what was a tumultuous week in the crypto space. Let's dive in. Further expanding the reach of digital carbon, ClimaDAO released its Fiat to Retirement service, enabling tokenized carbon credits to be retired via credit card. This means a Web3 wallet is no longer a requirement to participate in the on-chain VCM. The World Economic Forum's Carbon Credits Working Group, part of the Crypto Sustainability Coalition, is developing recommendations for carbon credits on-chain and needs input from the refi space on pain points and opportunities. The survey can be accessed in the link below. On November 16th, Flora Ventures will be hosting a Web3 by Climate Showcase, where several refi actors, including Solid World DAO and Moss, will present on how they are utilizing blockchain to address the climate crisis. You can sign up to the webinar in the links below. The winners of the Sovereign Nature Initiative by Kenya Wildlife Trust Hackathon were announced this week. Entrants pitched ideas on how to use Web3 tech to address predator conservation challenges in Kenya's Maasai Mara, offering a hint of ReFi's possibilities. Early bird tickets have been released for the ReFi India Summit on December 1st in Bangalore. Offering a one-day crash course in all things ReFi, participants will be able to find out more about the opportunities, grants, and jobs available in this space. Finally, Mercy Corps Ventures is hosting a Twitter space on Monday, November 14th, focused on the opportunities for increasing adoption and scaling ReFi. Set a reminder or catch up on the recording in the link below. That wraps up this week in ReFi. Be sure to catch up with us again next week. And as always, thank you for tuning in.